Okay, we have something going on here. It really looked like Splash was going to rub up against Boo because they're so happy they're going to have crunchies. And then Boo like lifted his paw at Splash because Boo doesn't understand the whole rubbing up against another cat thing. Stella, Splash, Simba, Hydrox, and Boo. The Lucky Ferals. It's 10 a.m. Who's having some playtime before breakfast? Something just happened here on the play rug between Boo and Simba, and I don't know what it was because I was in the other room, but I heard it. It was some kind of scuffle and then some hissing and swatting. I don't know who did what. But I do know that Boo has never hissed at the other cats. At least not while Boo's been in the house. When Boo was outside, he hissed sometimes. But since Boo's been in the house, he's never hissed at the other cats, ever. Okay, so this morning the cats are eating on their round autumn platter and had to sprinkle a few crunchies as usual. And Boo would still not come off of the second step, so I actually picked up Boo and I moved him next to the platter and uh, and he so far has had no problem eating off of it with the other cats. And Stella was eyeing the crunchies, so uh, I gave her the little lid with the crunchies in it. So she's happy with that for now and then she'll eat off the platter. The other cats are definitely more accepting of Boo now. See, look. There has not been any hissing or swatting or anything like that during feeding time today. There's a little bit of a squeeze up in the middle of the platter because they all had some squeeze up as a treat this morning. You can definitely see where Simba and Splash got their coloring from. Like Simba got Stella's tabby and his paws are black like Boo. And then Splash got his black from Boo and his white from Stella. You can see both sides of the family right now. It's really easy. Check this out. The cats just finished their breakfast. That worked out really well. They all ate everything that they wanted to eat and the platter is empty and Boo did not overeat because the other cats eat faster than he does when it comes to, when it comes to wet food, Boo is the slowest eater, but when it comes to crunchies, Boo is the fastest eater. It's funny how that works out. So here's Boo. He might go lick the platter clean. He might. 
And here's Stella. Stella's watching him. It is 1 p.m. Stella has been sleeping by the windows in Boo's room. I think one of the reasons why she's been getting along a bit better with him is because she has access to this room now. All the other cats actually now have access to this room because the only time that they don't is if I'm away for any extended period of time. And an extended period of time would be really anything more than a few hours. So the cats are much happier now that they have their old room back. And Boo is perfectly happy in the living room. His favorite cat towers in the living room and he also loves being in my room. Right, Boo? I just came downstairs. Look at how Splash is sleeping. He's so silly.
I gave Hydrox some food about 10 minutes ago and it was raining a little bit at the time. I guess it was just a very quick passing shower because now everything looks dry again. And it looks like Hydrax ate part of the wet food and now he's eating some of the dry food that's in the feeder. I harvested the first tomatoes from my yard today. These are some of the cherry tomatoes from my patio plants. I can't wait to eat these tomorrow. They are so sweet or actually I might eat these a little bit later as a snack. This is Stella's thing. This is what she's been doing lately, almost every night. So I have this paper bag from Whole Foods and um, I just tossed it here because um, I'm going to be recycling it. And Stella found it and every night she has to make herself comfortable on it. Like, so she's actually, she's laying on the bag but then she kind of tucks herself under the front of the bag. Do you like that, Stella? Is that comfortable? Good morning, Simba. Simba jumped on the bed because I told him we're going to have breakfast. Come on, Simba. Let's go have breakfast. Good morning, Boo. Are you ready for breakfast also? And there's Stella sitting on her paper bag. She doesn't like to go inside paper bags. She just likes to sit on top of them.
I just came outside. Look at Hydrox. He's sleeping in the grass. Oh my god, the neighbors are really yelling. The neighbors are yelling so loud they disrupted Hydrox. He's like, what is going on? Like, right now they quieted down a little bit, but I mean, just like yelling at each other on the top of their lungs. Look how beautiful this mint is growing in this pot. The only problem is that it's like taking over the geraniums. There's geraniums on this side. Um, so uh, what I've been doing is just like uh, making sure that I like cut off sprigs of mint every day. So I'm sitting here doing a photo shoot with Hydrox and there's a plate of food like literally a foot away from me and he just meowed and started walking towards me which is really good for Hydrox. Hydrox, you can eat your food. Go ahead, you can eat it. You want me to take more pictures of you? Is that what you want to do? You want to pose better for me? Oh, you're sitting up straight now, right? You're sitting up straight? Okay, I'll take more pictures. Hydrox is eating his food. I gave him two Sheba Perfect Portions because I found them um, in the closet downstairs. And they're quite old, but they're not expired yet. So that's what he got, along with a little bit of the squeeze up. Cat's got squeeze up this morning also. Right now I think it's maybe like 8.30 or 8.20. I was working late today and I just got home. And I don't want to jinx anything, but it has been getting easier to get Boo to eat on the platter with the other cats. The other cats are cool with him. There's no hissing, swatting, nothing. And uh, Boo's just a little bit hesitant at first. And I have to use a little bit of crunchies to uh, entice him, but again, I don't want to jinx anything. It has been less and less crunchies to get him to eat on the platter. The other cats eat so fast also. So, like today, I mean, the other cats just zoomed through their food and Boo's going to be taking his time, which is fine. Boo is finishing up the platter, and Stella's watching. Hello, Simba. How are you? I'm sitting here editing videos, and I just turned around, and Simba's on top of the cat tower. Look how Simba's laying in this cat tower. Simba is so funny. How is that comfortable? How can that be comfortable for him? Simba has decided he needs to remove the tag from the rug. There's like a little area rug here, a little throw rug. Of course the tag's still on it because I leave the tags on everything. But Simba doesn't like that. Simba likes to take the tags off. <laughs> 